Everyone has their own interests that can be done as a part-time job. For me, I chose video editing as my part-time job when I was studying. Although it sounds great, but it is a job that can be done if you have the skill. Hi guys, I'm Aima Akmal and in this video, I will share with you guys a little bit about my experience as a part-time video editor. But before we begin, let's play the intro. Video editing is my hobby since when I was in school. I started to learn video editing by myself. My journey began when I got an offer to make a farewell video for my former school principal in January 2019. At first, I was reluctant to do because I thought about my ability to make a good video. However, my parents, friends, and teachers have encouraged me to do that for my experience. Fortunately, my video has received a good feedback from everyone. And guess what? I got paid for the first time ever. My journey as a part-time video editor continues when I was pursuing my diploma studies in UITM Rembau. In there, I have joined a Media and Communication Students Club, MCSC, as a member of Multimedia Bureau. The peak of my career began when I have been asked to edit a video for a competition called CCVC that stands for Club Corporate Video Competition and gosh, MCSC has won that competition as the first winner. Because MCSC won that competition, many people asked who edited the video. Since then, my name went viral among lecturers as the individual who was editing the video. From there, I have received several video editing jobs from UITM Negeri Sembilan branch such as Work from Home Starter Kids video, Negeri Sembilan YPP's Candidate Nomination video, and UITM Negeri Sembilan Student Affairs Programs Montage videos. Thanks God, I got paid quite a lot for each video I made. Actually, I never thought that I would be able to reach this level and gain the trust from the UITM's administration. In every job, there must be some challenge. Among the challenge I have faced is when there is a problem with the footage given by the client. For example, when the footage are corrupted or out of focus. Other than that, I had to deal with a few technical problems like my computer being overhead or the software being crashed while editing. It is the part where I felt very stressed and give up. But after all, I know this is the reality to face as a video editor. Before we end, I want to give some advice to all part-time video editors, especially students. First thing first, never feel overconfident when editing a video. Watch more videos made by other people. In this way, existing editing skills can be improved and you will get inspiration from the videos you watch. Then, always learn new editing skills through YouTube or by participating in online or offline editing classes. Remember, Never think about the money, but think about the output. Finally, please manage your time wisely. Don't take any job if you are busy with your assignments. Alright guys, I think that's all I can share about my little experience as a part-time video editor. I hope it is useful for you guys, especially for those who are interested in. Thanks for watching. Assalamualaikum and bye.